Hello, hello. Happy Wednesday, September 1st, beginning of the month. And what does that mean? New type of program. So this month, we're going to focus on Tabata style. What is Tabata? 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, repeated for eight total rounds, and we have four blocks. It's going to be awesome. Also, uh, my eyes dry or something, but that's really bothering me. Okay. Uh, I apologize for the late video. A lot of you probably won't notice, but to be honest anyway, I just got back from vacation. And so this is uh, posted a little bit later than normal, but here we are. We're going to do it. We're going to rock this workout. Okay. Let me just cry a little bit here. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. All right, we'll do our normal warm up here. Tuck the tailbone, round the spine, look at the belly button. Arch your back, drop your chest, head comes neutral. Inhale, exhale. Just got back from Vegas. Fun little girls trip, it was awesome. Uh, and that's pretty much it. I was like, I'm gonna record this later. All right, uh, opposite arm, opposite leg. So if I haven't said this already, which I know I haven't, you're gonna grab a light and heavy set of dumbbells. We're gonna do both upper and lower body. So just find one or two dumbbells that feel good for you. T spine twist. Clearly, I'm very out of it. Is this normal? Yeah, this is me all the time. <laughs> all right, turn seconds. We'll switch sides. Right. Inhale, tap, exhale, twist. All right, scap another push up. I'm feeling knees today. We're gonna stay on the knees. Watch your head for bulging forward while you do this. Also, there's a little rest. Okay, 10 seconds we're gonna go into your back. We'll do the rest on the back. Three, two. And one on your back. Pull the bridge. Make sure while you're at the top position, not to arch your back, soft ribs, tuck the tailbone. Go from there. Okay, from here, we're gonna do our toe taps. If you need to put your hands under your hips, I would recommend it. I like to do that. And your goal here is to keep that 90 degree bend, but extend from the hip. Reach a little further. Maybe you curl your toes like I'm doing. I didn't realize I was doing that. Okay, windshield wiper. Arms out at the T, knees to the right, opposite shoulder pushes down, knees to the left. Exhale as you twist, inhale as you come up to center. All right, 
right, in 10 seconds, we're gonna have our last one on your back, which is your dead bug. Opposite arm, opposite leg. If this doesn't feel good, you can do it on the feet on the ground. Hands are falling down. Okay, in 10 seconds, we're gonna sit upright and do our hip flexors. And we're going right into it. Ooh, my hair looks great. Right here it is. Ooh, the side that really burns. It's good, it's good to do it. Ooh, okay, in 10 seconds, we switch sides and then we start the actual workout. We haven't done Tabati yet. Not as an actual full workout. I'm excited. It's going to be good. Not Tabata with like full compound movements, which means like full body movements. We usually do it with like cardio and abs, but this is going to be great. All right. I'm trying to distract from the hip pain in a good way. It's a good burn. Okay. Last time we're never done with the warm up. Five, three, two, and one, rest. All right, let's get started. I might throw my contact out, who knows? Mid-workout. All right, we are gonna do, excuse me while I change the time while talking to you guys. Okay, we're gonna do 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, so high intensity for 20 seconds, and then you rest and recover for 10, and then you repeat it for eight rounds. Hello. Okay, so your first one's gonna be a goblet squat, and then followed by squat jumps. That's right. Hopefully your legs are burning by the end of this. Uh, trying to kill you guys. It's gonna be great. Okay, so squat, or goblet squat looks like this. Hold the dumbbell like this, hug it with your forearms, squat. Then you're gonna drop it and do squat jumps, okay? We're gonna do four of each, which makes it eight rounds. Cool. Any questions? You're gonna have to ask in the comments. What? All right, so let me get the timer going, get the music going, and then we'll get ready to rumble, all right. First one's goblet squat in three, two, and one. Let's do it. What is this song? And rest. Okay, this is good. We're just starting. All right, squat jump, here it is. Midi jump, it doesn't have to be too high. Just get your heart rate up. Make sure you're absorbing the landing. Knees are pushed out. Three, two, and one, rest. Strength and cardio, we got this. Back to goblet squats. Three, two, and one. Goblet squat. And rest. Okay, squat jumps. Round two of squat jumps. And rest. Woohoo! Two more of each. We got this. Squat. Goblet 
which looks like this. We're gonna be on the ground, so let me lower that. Can you see me? Great, awesome. Okay, got my dumbbells here, chest press. And then for skull crusher, I'm probably just gonna use one. Most of you have two light ones, which I do, I just need to grab them. Skull crusher, okay. For skull crusher, you're hinging at the elbow, aiming towards your skull. Don't drop it. All right, are we ready? Block two, chest press. Let's do it. And rest. Okay, grabbing one of your dumbbells. This button's not feeling great on my head. There we go. Okay, grab one of your dumbbells. Skull pressure. Bring your elbows in. Aim towards your forehead or a little bit past it. Press up. This pressing up, try to push your knuckles forward and you'll feel a little bit more triceps too. Ooh, up triceps. Heck yeah, we do. And rest. Okay, back to chest press. I'm not really feeling the song. I'm gonna change it. You guys keep going. All right, here it is. Triceps. Like I said, elbows in. You're hinging at the elbows. I don't want you pulling from the shoulder. We want to work our triceps, not our shoulders. Maybe shoulders later. Okay. Two down, two to go. We got this. Press. Maybe this time your legs are up. Who knows? We'll add a little abs in there. Are 
right, stick your feet up if you want. Crawl into your abs a little bit more, why not? Apples forward. And rest. Yeah, this is starting to burn. Okay, one more beach. Here it is. Maybe this time we add a little hips. Who knows? You're still working your chest. Just want to distract you from pain. Is that too excited? Maybe. Oh my gosh. Burning. I'm feeling triceps on this one too. Good. And rest. All right. Plus skull crusher. I'm going to keep doing those hip thrusters. And by hip thrusters, I mean blue bridge. And rest. There it is. Two blocks done, two to go. Speaking of hip thrusters, we're going to do a glute bridge and then some marchers. I'll show you what that looks like while you guys take it. Take in this bun that I just created. Okay, so number one is gonna be blue bridge. Then you're gonna keep your hips in the air and you're gonna march. Now I'm really good at arching my back. So I'm gonna try really hard here to lift up, tuck the tailbone, abs are soft, and march from here while keeping my hips level. That's the goal here. And otherwise your booty should be burning by the end of this. Are we ready? Yes, we are. Okay, here it is. We'll do a regular glute bridge for the first two rounds. And then we'll add a little frog bridge on the second two. Ten seconds. And rest. Okay, this next one. If you want to just march with your feet down, you can. A little bit harder will be hips in the air. That's really what's going to work with me. Okay, hips up, hold it there, march. Keep that tailbone tucked. Like I said earlier, that I'm having a hard time doing. Woo! Crack. We're back to the regular blue bridge. Regular in what sense? I don't know. All right, bridge. You can totally add weight to this. What am I thinking? No, let's add weight. Ten seconds. Oh, that felt better. I like that one. Okay, back to hip thrust. I mean, marchers. I'm out of it. So in vacation mode. Keep it level, keep it level. Okay. Like I said earlier, we're going to do frog bridge. You can still add weight. Options, you can do no weight. That's fine too. Okay, bottoms of the feet together, and we're going to approach it from here. That just takes your hip flexors out of it. Okay, second to last marchers. Quick little back crack. Okay. Push your shoulders, push your elbows, march. Really drive your upper body into the ground. Ten 
10. Last frog bridge with the weight. Here it is. Okay, marching. Ooh, we have one left after this. We're working our back after this. Okay, marching. You want your best, you want to do your best by keeping your hips level and not slamming your foot into the ground. It's a nice smooth transition. And rest. Okay, block number three is done. We have one more after this. So we're gonna row and we're gonna fly. Okay, I'm gonna grab both of these dumbbells real quick. You can do these standing. I prefer seated because I have a wacky lower back as you guys all know from TikTok. Not that I'm an expert at anything, but I just know what works for me. All right, so number one, we're gonna row. Number two, we're gonna fly. Cool, 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 cool. So I have a heavy and light set of dumbbells because the row, I can probably row heavier, but with the fly, no chance. All right, we're ready? My hair is ready, here it is. We'll start with the rowing. So a lot of people like to row with their elbows out. Don't do that. Okay. Pull your elbows straight back, squeeze the shoulder blades. Control it on the way down. You can totally do this standing. If you're like, I don't feel my back, do it standing. Try it. Okay, next one's a fly. I'm switching to my lighter ones. YouTube really likes to grab the screenshots of like when my, like, I look great. This is probably gonna be the screenshot they're gonna take as the cover photo. Can't wait. And rest. Not feeling this song. I can always play this song. Sure, 
Lord. We did it, Bab. We're so close. I think we have time to do more than just four blocks. What am I thinking? This is our last one. This is literally our last five seconds here. All right, that's enough. We're good? We feel good? <laughs> I'm burning. All right, grab your block. Some of you are like, wait, what? You didn't ask us to get a block. We're just gonna use a block. All right, we're gonna stretch hand. 90, 90. Inside hand reaches over outside knee and back foot lifts up. Inhale, exhale. Four, five, and six. Inhale, exhale. Oh, that's tighter. Five and six. Okay, right, open book. Hold your top knee down. Inhale here, exhale. Here's five and six. All right, other side. That's it. Your workout was fast today. We did this whole month. Oh, that cracked. Two. Here's five and six. And just like that, you've completed your workout. Congratulations. Woohoo. All right. I will see you all next week for your Tabata part two. All right. See you later.